Well, hey everybody, Faith and Fishing here. Got another great show for you today. Um, got an opportunity here on this beautiful Saturday afternoon to get out here, hit the water, get some fishing at. Uh, my son's caught uh, several bass in that so far. We're hoping to catch some more. I haven't had any success yet, which is unusual but you know day's still early it's mid-afternoon so stay tuned hopefully we'll have some more footage for you in that and hope you guys had an opportunity to get out and enjoy this nice beautiful day today get out do some fishing take the family out go out with some friends do some fishing guys all right stay tuned and hope you enjoy this week's show Hey guys, as I sit here, and as I often do when I'm sitting here fishing, I'm always reminded to be patient, and that our patience has its rewards. Um, for us fishermen, our reward is enduring and catching the fish. Um, and a lot of this can easily swing over to our faith in God. And much like being patient here and it having its rewards, being patient with God has its rewards as well too. They may not always be what we want or what we think, but God always makes the decisions that are best for us. Um, even if it's losing someone we love, there's a reason for that. There's things that happen that are terrible to some of us that they happen for a reason. Um, what that reason is, we will not ever know. We can only guess what God's plan and reason was for it. Now, the, the most important factor of this all is to keep your faith. Just when things are getting tough and you're, you're down and you're out, always turn to God. Always know you can turn to God, no matter what it is. God is there, He's listening, and He's working diligently on coming up with what is best for each and every single one of us but you have to have your faith without faith we're just vessels in the ocean drifting and wandering aimlessly floating in the drift and it's God who blows the wind into our sails to get us to our destination not always know where that wind's going to come from, where it's going to take us, but it's always going to take us someplace. And I just hope that I'm able to reach all of you, and whether you're, you know, have a strong faith in God now, or maybe you have some doubts you're questioning your faith or maybe you're just a non-believer in the first place no matter what your ministers your reverends your pastors they're always here for you a lot of people don't realize or know it that ministers and reverends and pastors we're all trained in counseling and that is part of our job most uh, Reverends and that will more along the lines of when it comes to counseling, it'll be more of faith based counseling um, where you know they're counseling for you to help you get your faith. Um, where counseling that I do with um, some people isn't just faith based, it is also you know the reality of the life that we exist here on this plane and 
what we can do for each other to help support each other and, and, and help strengthen each other here and reassure and remind everybody there are people out here that do care. Um, so I advise everyone to reach out to your pastor, your minister, your reverend, you know, talk to them. They're more than happy to listen. Um, if you guys have anything that you want to talk to me about as well, I'm more than happy to lend my ear and listen and offer any advice that I can possibly give you to steer you in the right direction or keep you on the straight and narrow. Um, my door's always open for you guys. Um, so I hope everybody uh, takes an opportunity and utilizes that. Um, the wonderful thing I have found since becoming a minister is I've always enjoyed helping people and now I get even greater pleasure from being able to help people and I look forward to being able to help all of you so with that being said I think I'm gonna turn around here get back to fishing uh, I was hoping maybe I'd get one on the line while I was filming here but that didn't happen my son Zach he's been uh, landing bass after bass after bass here down the shore from me where I've had some nibbles but I haven't had anything stick so not looking real hot for me as at this moment he's uh, definitely out fishing me today which is kind of unusual considering he doesn't typically really catch fish very often and here he is he's out doing his old man so I'm really proud of him and well Stay tuned, guys. I uh, hope you enjoy this week's show. If you haven't already done so, please uh, like and subscribe. Um, remember, feel free if you have any comments you want to see in an upcoming show, ideas. I'm always open for ideas. Uh, fishing destinations, uh, bait, tackle, anything that you guys want uh, here discussed. Um, you know... I'm up I'm up for it so keep the comments coming message us on our Facebook page our web page or even right here on our YouTube channel and we'll get back to you as soon as we can stay tuned guys well this marks number four for junior here he's uh, definitely out fishing me right now but I've been getting some bites in that finally so hopefully We'll catch up and pass them here in a minute. Stay tuned, guys.